Hey guys, welcome to your uh, energy check-in for Cancer. This is going to be for the uh, second half of your November from the 16th to the 30th. We are going to take a look at your overall energies, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys can expect. So uh, apply this to your own unique situations, like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that is dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Also, if you guys are interested in wanting to uh, book a personal reading with me, the link for that is also in the description box below. So let's get started here for Cancer. Let's have a lot of Cancer here. Energy checking for Cancer. Over energies for Cancer for the second half of their November from the 16th to the 30th for Cancer. Okay, so uh, we have the Two of Cups, Temperance, Sagittarius Energy, Four of Wands, mm -hmm. uh, Page of Cups, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Seems like you're dealing with a divine counterpart here. Or I do feel like in the situation here, some here could be coming in with a, some sort of offer here because I do feel like someone here is feeling very lonely without you. Yeah, it seems like there's someone here that's coming back around with an apology with some sort of offer here, okay? Whoever this is, I don't. I feel like this person doesn't really want to lose you or lose out on this opportunity here with you, Cancer. Okay, I, whoever this is, I just feel like this person misses what they have with you here. Knight of Pentacles here and the Two of Cups. The Temperance card here and the Magician here, yeah. Uh, whoever this is, I feel like this person wants to do everything that they can to bring this relationship back together here. I just feel like this person wants to heal the situation. I feel like this person wants to regain your trust here, okay? I feel like this person is looking for your forgiveness. We have the Four of Wands and the Justice card. Whoever this person is, this person's definitely looking for marriage and commitment. I mean, some of you could be proposing. Why is this Five of Pentacles here? And the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, it just seems it seems like some of you is coming back around. But you know, it could also be a situation that cancer is that you could have learned your lessons and moved on from the situation here. So the Wheel of Fortune. The Sun and the Hangman, Piscean Energy. And also the Emperor here, Aries Energy. Yeah, it does seem like someone here is making you some sort of offer here. So you're coming up as, as this uh, Emperor here, or this younger individual, or this more immature individual here is coming in to make you some sort of offer here. Yeah, whoever this is, I just feel like this person's hung up on you or that this person can't let you go, Cancer, okay? What else do we have for Cancer? What else does Cancer need to know? Look out for work on for November, second half of their November from the 16th to the 30th. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Cancer, for Cancer here, for Cancer. Okay, so we have the Seven of Swords. You know, I wouldn't really put all my eggs into one basket with this individual because I feel like this person is just not really trustworthy. Yeah, if this person has shown you time and time again is that, you know, that they broke your trust here, just take it for face value here, Cancer. Whatever this person says, whatever this person does, it doesn't matter because what they're saying, their actions are not backing it up. They're not backing up what their actions here, okay? The Nine of Cups. Yeah, don't confuse yourself. Just accept it for face value. Yeah, just accept it for face value here. The Queen of Swords. Look, the Queen of Swords and the King of Pentacles. Both of you guys are not on the same page here, okay? King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. The Queen of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, and the Moon. 
seems like this, this is an individual that's hiding a lot from you here. You know, their own fears, their own worries here, okay? This person has secrets here too, or that this person is really secretive or very mysterious. I mean, you might view this person as an enigma or something like that. All right, Seven of Swords, Ten of Wands. Wow. I, I feel like this person's not really completely being honest with you. Yeah, you know, this person is lying a lot, or that this person has lied to you a lot. Three of Pentacles and the Page of Swords, Nine of Cups, and the King of Swords. We've got the King to Queen of Swords. It does seem like someone here is definitely spying on you, watching you here, but I, I do see this person coming in with an apology here. Yeah, I'm having a hard time trusting this person or trusting this energy that's coming back around. Definitely have some sort of strong soul tie here. Yeah, the Queen of Swords. Four Cups. Seems like you guys are looking for an explanation from this individual here. <clears throat> yeah, you know, one of the things, it's a cliche, but I feel like when someone shows you who they are, trust it, believe it. Yeah. Just believe what this person is showing you here. Just, 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 I just feel like this person is just not honest here, okay? Or that this person feels like they could get away with the things that they've done to you here. We have the lovers here. Gemini energy and the moon. And the five of cups. You know, I, it just seems like secretly here. I do feel like this person is definitely dealing with some sort of remorse and some sort of regret here. Yeah, whoever this is, I do feel like this person is going to approach you here. I do feel like this person's definitely missing you a lot here because I do believe that there's separation here, especially with the Five of Pentacles here, because I feel like they're feeling very lonely without you. But like I said, I would not put all my eggs into one basket with this individual here because this person can't be trusted. And I feel like you know that this person can't be trusted here with the King of Cups, the High Priestess. You know, this person has a lot of secrets here. And I feel like one of the things with the Judgment card here, I feel like it's time for you to find some sort of closure here because I do feel like there's a situation that's not working out. Ace of Swords and the Fool card, yeah, you're not giving to the situation anymore. Uh, you're cutting this out and you're moving on here. Yeah, I feel like because of, what ha because of what has gone down between you and your person here, your feelings towards them has changed, okay? Your feelings towards them has changed, so Cancer. I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. And I will speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.